Hello, my name is Mark from jazzguitarlessons.net and you're watching the jazzguitarlessons.net vlog for which you have a, an amazing view of my microwave in my kitchen. We are March 7th already, it is Monday, and I'm uh, packing up on caffeine, double long espresso here, before going into shooting mode, so there's a few things that happened. Well, it was my birthday recently, so I partied during the re weekend. There's no real practice that I've done or, or work or serious work I've done. You know, answering emails and teaching lessons, of course. But here's the um, the prime reason for this vlog. Now, the, the big news is I always don't know where to look. Should I look here or there? I, okay, camera's here. Sorry. Uh, there is a new course by Greg Amiro, which was one of my teachers and one of my, in fact, favorite players to see live in Montreal. Great trio jazz guitarist. He's looking up. He's a McGill University teacher, and he's publishing a course on Jazz Guitar Store, on my on my store, it's an honor. It's called All the Arpeggios You Are. So it's a really interesting course on how to create modern kind of jazz guitar lines with leaps within the basic seventh arpeggio. So the course is really step-by-step, step, starting with basic, you know, minor seven, dominant seven, major seven chords. And then it goes, oh boy, do I shake. Oh boy, do I shake, I'm sorry. So um, he's going into all the way through getting you to play a study on all the things you are using these really cool arpeggios. So I'm all swell, you know, new haircut, black shirt, because I'm drinking coffee, so I'm getting to shooting mode in the studio. I'm going to, you know, plug in the GoPro and just blabber, shoot a whole bunch of instructions, because as you know, that's what I do with the courses. Uh, you take a course and it's not just, here's the materials. Like then I have a video where I explain you what to do with that stuff. So that's coming up this afternoon. You see it's three, is that the right? Yes, it's almost on time, 3.18 p.m. So I'll be doing this most of the night and big news, I'll be talking with my uh, good friend which uh, will sing to me or will build the main theme on my new jazz guitar album that will be released in 2016. So this is pretty exciting. My intention is to you know, discuss with him on Skype having sing, sing some stuff and he's not a musician or anything but we'll use that on the album as a main theme and I'm going to have this album be the same, um, this idea of community, co communal album. So I'll ask friends and students and people, uh, even my fiance, will write a little theme and we'll use that to uh, to make the album. So there'll be a lot of improv and stuff, but the composition, I want it to be like uh, social based, which will be a thing. So anyways, I'll let you go. I'm off to shooting videos on the studio. Take care, check out uh, all the arpeggios you are. Uh, officially, it's there, it's on the store already. Also check out for Greg Amiro's album and there's a soul guitar arrangement of In a Sentimental Mood that you can get from the store. It's it's amazing, open string stuff, beautiful arrangements, really a neat, uh, a neat way to chord melodize In a Sentimental Mood. And I will see you soon on the website and uh, keep me posted in the comments. Take care, bye.